Yo, what's going on guys? JVH here and today I'm continuing on my weekend's worth of racing at the Winton Raceway where we're going to move from a Formula Ford car yesterday to a Touring Car Masters car today. The Touring Car Masters series, if you don't know, is a sort of historic racing series in Australia where they get a bunch of touring cars from a, the Australian pastime. I think it's like 60s and 70s. I don't actually remember the exact parameters of the series in terms of the years they get the cars from. Now, although we don't have any Touring Car Masters mods sort of available to us on uh, R Factor 2, we do have this Aussie Legend mod which has a lot of the same cars that compete in the series and that's what we're going to be using today so without any further ado i'm going to go run a quick qualifying session see where we stack up and then we'll kick off the video from there okay so qualified sixth out of the 18 cars once again like yesterday in the form board five lap race uh we got the ai set to 100 percent difficulty uh, sorry 110 percent difficulty uh, ai aggression set to 40 percent damage set on max all righty here we go Let's just try and get this big beast off the line. Oh, decent jump. Oh no, second stage wasn't too good, but we got a little bit of a run on the cars in front. Ooh, no gap there. And these things bounce around so much. Power down. Oh, there's a bit of grass there. Now, as you may have noticed, this probably isn't the most up-to-date version of uh, the Winton Raceway, but it's the most realistic version I could find. I mean, the layout's pretty much all the same. It's just going to be a few curbs here and there. I do believe this is actually converted from R-Factor 1, so... Yeah, that's how old it is. <laughs> oh, pick that front tyre up. <laughs> I think I may have set the uh, suspension a little bit too soft. Let's just try and keep with these front three. Only got five laps, so I've got to make a move. I want to be in fourth. All right. So bumpy under brakes in that corner. Oh, battle for the lead. So we are driving a 1978 Ford XC. Uh, at least that's what it's called on the mod. I really don't know anything about historic touring cars in Australia, to be completely honest. Oh, hello. Overshot the apex there, just a tad. Turn into bumper cars here. Oh, <laughs> just I keep sort of um, mistaking the length of this car. <laughs> I mean, these cars they do have quite a bit of grip, but due to the length and the suspension, and uh, it just do not transition well at all. As you can see, this thing just wants to hop. Mind you, I haven't set this car up too good to be honest. old Tirana in front of us. These things are so small and short. I mean, no wonder they were so quick. Let's see what the speed differential is like. Pretty even, to be honest. Talk. Alright. Time to make a move. Pull it up. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Ah! Damn it. No. Ah, shit. Well, that didn't go according to plan. Alright. Uh, oh, leaders off into the distance. Let's just see if we can get a podium back now.
Yeah, this is handling like more like a super truck than an actual touring car. <laughs> Ooh. I keep forgetting what gear. I mean, I haven't got the uh, gear select on the dash. You just got to do it by feeling these things. Oh, Jesus. Uh, this thing just does not want to go in a straight line. Uh, actually, no. It does want to go in a straight line. It just doesn't want to turn or stop. Two laps to go. Let's just see if we can get this podium and hold on to it. This Tirana is not as quick in the race as what it was in qualifying. Oh, oh no, 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 we've had contact. Oh, no, where's the track? No. Oh, just go. Oh, I, don't, I don't, don't, do not even know where I am right now. Hold on. Okay. Wait, no, there it is. I think that's where we got to get. It's one of these tracks where you can literally. Uh, sit anywhere on the track and actually watch the race. It's kind of cool. Alright, unsafe rejoin, but why not? Oh, jeez. I apologise. <laughs> oh, that's not gone well, lads. <laughs> We've just gone from, like, 4th down to 16th. I don't know what happened there. I think I got sideways and my right rear got clipped with his, I don't know, left front or something. But, anyway, let's just get as many positions as we can. It's fun race, nonetheless. These cars are awesome fun. Big dive bomb. Not matching the revs well enough. Ah! So I keep locking up the rears by not heel and towing and flipping that throttle enough. about dented every single panel in this poor car. <laughs> Just using all these curbs, munch them up. Terrible drive for me, I do admit. <laughs> this has been awful. So many mistakes. I mean, I am going from a Formula Ford to a historic touring car to a modern day touring car, and I, <laughs> my brain just can't quite keep up with all that chopping and changing. Let's see if we can get this one last guy. Come on, bow down. No. Oh, that's too much curb. Alright, we cut the track <laughs> to make a move, but oh well. It is what it is. 14th place. Uh, yeah, that was a terrible, terrible drive from myself, but still a bit of fun. Uh, gotta love racing these cars, man. They are just so iconic. Good old Aussie muscle, mate. Alright. Well, thanks guys for tuning in. Stay tuned. We'll be in the uh, Supercar Series, a brand new 2020 Supercar Series mod uh, tomorrow. And hopefully we can do a lot better in that than what we've done in this. Well, until next time, I'll catch you guys later.